And I got pictures of the last one too. This is the. Oh, I don't turn the brightness up. That's the same thing as this. No, it's a different one, and it's worse. But it's, I mean, it, it's a very similar. Right. Same concept. Same concept, but there's Can more pages. That? Yeah, yeah. There's there's four pages here. Well, I took four pictures. And that one I gave to the other officer when I made the previous report and took it with them. I hope they were doing new fingerprints or something or whatever. But the same thing. They put it. I know they put it in your guys' mailbox, right? They put it. Hey, you got the flyer. I'm important to him, right? The one saying I'm a sex offender and shit. You got it in your mailbox. You don't have to get involved, but someone put it in your mailbox. There you go. Oh, now I'm on public. Yeah, but you can't even tell the cop here whether or not you got illegal correspondence in your mail. It's a crime for people to be putting stuff in your mailbox. Yeah, I'm not harassing you. I'm not on your property. Get fucked. I'm not on their property. Okay. Like my sandal was touching one of their stones. Yeah, well, I know for a fact they did because I saw it in their mailbox and my roommate here has explained to other people around the park. Give me a second. Let me look up the previous history. Yeah. And that dude, it's 8562. Not, I have the address. It's not 512, Corey Core. I don't know where I... I could have sworn. It's been several years since I saved it, but I've got it saved on my computer and I looked up the address. So yeah, he's made it clear he's going to continue the practice. And the reason these people are being such dicks to me is they got a flyer calling me a child molester and shit. It's not true. My stalker is Richard Crow, Megan's Law pedophile. He's the leader of the Troll Brigade Mafia. I'm their victim. I met this dude one time in 2015 for a protest about service dog rights. That's it. A civil rights protest and someone that likes filming the police wanted to come see it. That's our entire history. That's all there was to it. And these are his buddies. And their terror team. And they lie through their fucking teeth. And it's a crime. I talked to the postmaster. I spent a half a day talking to them. And they agreed it is a crime to put stuff in people's mailboxes, but you guys are the ones responsible and to call you back. And you guys, I'd already called you first, and you guys sent me to the post office, and the post office sent me back to you. So it's a, you're pointing fingers at each other's situation. But it's illegal. I confirmed it is illegal for them to put stuff in people's mailboxes. Oh, and the harassing messages, uh, it's all bad, but I mean, I guess the stalking and coming here and handing out flyers, calling me a pedophile, that's going to take um, the priority, whatever. Oh, and doxing too. It's a photocopy of my ID. Doxing is a penal code. I don't have it handy, but I've looked it up before. There's a penal code about doxing. So photocopying my ID and putting it in people's mailboxes, separate of it being crime to put stuff in people's mailboxes, is also doxing. So this is not good five ways to Sunday. Because that's my real address and stuff on there. It's a business center I keep. It's on my business cards and stuff. If people go there harassing me, I have business relations with the guy there like it's it's that's my place like like harassment directed at the address listed on there will target the people I associate with yeah so I've seen that you called multiple times um uh, kind of same incident about harassment you similar yeah but it's ongoing and remember that with the one about talking about my long lost service dogs was 558 this morning Oh, this morning? Okay. Yeah, so I mean, yeah, continuing right up till. Basically, I take sleeping pills and sleep in. I just noticed. I just got on. I get many emails from my business stuff, so I just became aware. 
yeah, it's a few hours old, but yeah, today he was harassing me. Okay. And he lives uh, up here, up at Riverside, 20, 30 minutes drive. Okay. So, you know, maybe I'm going to be seeing this dude again. And he is definitely armed. I was going to say, if you see him again, call us. Don't approach him. Um, well, I kind of have to. Tell I, police what you you're have a cop, you know, 21 feet. I, I got to go. I see, If I see him, we got to fight to the death. It's got to be on. I don't want you to get in trouble, and I don't want him to get in trouble. But I want to die, and he's made it th- clear he wants to kill me. Okay. He's making it clear. I have got a video of me, him, and a cop standing and trying. He tells the cop, yeah, I got a gun. It's right here. Do you feel like this dude yourself? is armed. Huh? Do you feel like hurting yourself? No. Because you said you want to die. Or no, I said I have to prevent him from hurting me. Okay. If I see him, I don't have time to get on the phone. We've I've tried all that. I got video of him stalking me back in Lake Forest and him sitting down in front of me and me calling the cops and y'all coming and doing nothing, letting him go. I got to fight. Okay. It's, my, it's a serious threat. Okay. He is a dangerous person. Um, continue to collect whatever's in the mailbox and keep calling. We'll give you an incident. Well, that's another thing. I can collect what comes to our mailbox, but I can't get in other people's mailboxes. But I am sure they, I saw it in their mailbox. And many other neighbors here have come to my roommates and landlord and and complained that they got the same notice. That's all around the park, not just the street. um, Whoever the property manager is for the complex, ask them, send them an email maybe. About trespassing. um, Not only that, but hey, if there's anyone getting um, any mail with my ID picture, could you let me know so I can come collect and document it and I will definitely try place. to do that they're just okay. not friendly with me up there anyway I but yeah you're understand. you're right if any of the other tenant yes you know that's what I mean? but that's what's essentially happened because I rent from my landlord here and she has gotten complaints about that it's a small lady right I think I yes the little lady yeah, yeah. people have come to her about getting those flyers all around the park okay try to get a restraining order on her as well because on I her I already did with her but it's not her this time with this but the judge rejected the restraining order said I had no reason to fear the little girl like that you all told me to go through all that. I did, I did the motion. The judge just didn't even want to hear it for me being a big guy or whatever. Even though her new employee pepper yeah. sprayed me. Like the dude she hired. It's just a Latino I'm labor. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Then um, I don't know what issues you have with your neighbors. But if you need to go that route and get a restraining on your neighbors, you have to go that route. You know what I mean? Well, he's not a neighbor. He's, he, he's, he lives in Riverside, but it's well, not, 20, not, 30 minutes. Not up. him, but like people that came out, you guys were yip yapping. Whatever that was about, you could get a restraining order on them as well. Yeah, they're looking down on me because of these flyers. And they've been misinformed. That's okay. it. That's that's this is the effects of that. They we were on good for terms. Okay. Uh, if you like, I would go and talk to them. Yes, please do. Ask them if they got such letter in their mailbox. Okay. I'll ask them. Um, I know they said they don't want to cooperate or anything with the investigation. So if they tell me to screw off, then it is what it is. But at least I tried to talk to them, okay? Oh, you should at least try because I yeah. know they did. I okay. saw it. I know they did. Okay. Could you just wait for me over there? Then sure. I'll yeah. keep you posted, okay? Check the airs. I used a public pump for my front tire, and it doesn't have a, a meter.
Oh, convenient, man. Hey, I'm reporting shit about my stalkers. They're on another bender. Can you please talk to the cop and tell them what you said about other people getting those flyers in the mail? Everybody got them here. Yeah, everyone, I would need you to, as a witness to tell the cop that. He's right here talking to her about the same thing. We're not getting them. Though. Okay. All on his, on his. Just the same thing you told me, yeah. The same thing. That's, that's yeah, I know, but he... he, he they, these people call me schizophrenic and crazy. They say I'm crazy. Stay, stay back there. Yeah, just go tell them. Uh, he's around the corner. So you said everyone got them. That's the story I got. Everyone got them. Everyone bar none. Yeah, see, man, they like to call me crazy and say it's not happening. There are no other witnesses besides me. I keep complaining and saying it's happening, it's happening. But you told them that everyone got them? But you don't have a video where they show somebody Let's putting Let's go! Them. I'm leaving. The police part is part of their investigation. Well, you need to stop this. You don't have video. It's, it's the report you made. Yeah, saying. but other people got those flyers, right? A bunch, everyone, according to you, got those flyers, right? Yeah, this, this.
Hey, did he tell you? The guy, the guy just came and talked to you, Mario. No, he left. He came up. Yeah, to but me. he told you that everybody got those flyers, right? No, he didn't tell me that. So he came up to me. He just said it on video. I got it on video. Okay. Um, he came up to me. And he was like, "Hey," and he kind of just went to his car and then left. So there was nothing on that end. So I just caught him on video saying it. He's the one that told me that people came to him from all around the park saying they got those flyers and he you just said on video. Do you happen to have his phone number? Like contact him? Yeah, I do. I Hold on. I think I do. Just said on camera and that I got to say, yeah, everyone got those. And he, they came to me with that complaint that everyone in the park had got those. Okay. Multiple right, times. All right. Well, use that business card, okay? Um, that's and, the and dude, lose the bond. I know where this dude lives. Can, can't you go check his address out? It's out of the county because in Riverside. Rivers, so yeah. It's, oh, it's city district. Yeah, night. so you have to go over no, there. Hold on, I don't know, I don't know. I don't know the exact. Uh, it may not be. Let me show you the map where it is. Because I don't know where the county lines are and stuff, but I do have right there by the Air Force Base. Right there. Yeah. That's out. So we we go up to basically California Road. So that's so what I'd suggest is you go over there and contact Riverside Sheriff's. Oh, we did. I've already back in 2019. I did that all happened. Wow. His buddy that got pissed at him, doxed him, and gave me his address. That's how I know who he is and where he lives. And I showed up on his, it's his mother in law's house. And sure enough, I knocked at the door, 20 police came and everything. That's the one I was just telling you about earlier where he yeah, said I got a gun. It's right here. Okay. He was telling the cop that. Well, yeah, I've tried. It's been 2015 is where I met this group. All right, sir. Well, I just got another call, so I have to go, okay? Best of luck to you. Yeah, uh, Mario didn't tell you that uh, everyone I'm a call. got those flyers? I have the address, so I'm going to call and see if. Um, they, they say anything. If they do, I'm going to document it on my... Uh, well, I got it on video. No, guys. The video that I'm posting this right now is going to show him saying everybody got them, okay. which is what he told me several times convincingly, and I've seen it. And Do they tell you? The girls tell you they got the flyer. No, they didn't give it to I saw it in their mailbox. Okay. Uh-oh, that's not good. Mario could have fucking let that cop know. We all, you all saw what he said, and that's exactly what he told me. That everybody got him. Everybody. And I saw it in the neighbor's mailbox, physically. And the people, he specifically said from all around the park, not on this street, over in the front and stuff, he, he elaborated to me and said, Everybody. Everybody. 